Good morning, everybody. Welcome. Uh, thanks for uh, coming out here to the WITS Training Center. And today I want to share with you a presentation called Wi-Fi Best Practices for Enterprise, Turning Bad Fi into Great Fi. How many of you have experienced Bad Fi? How many of you have experienced Great Fi? Not quite as many as, okay. Uh, by the way, were they the same Wi-Fi at the same? It's amazing how often we see that the Wi-Fi that's been installed uh, appears to be good under some cir circumstances and other times it's terrible. And the reason why is because that's the nature of Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is like this. It's wavy. It's up and down. It's here and there. It comes and goes. It never stays the same. It's just the nature of Wi-Fi. So when it comes to installing and configuring and maintaining and troubleshooting Wi-Fi, there's uh, just a whole lot of different variables that are not immediately obvious to everyone. That's what we want to talk about today. I want to give you some fundamental, basic best practices that you can use under any circumstances, but these have been defined most, uh, most pointedly for enterprise. Now, enterprise. Now, Ben, when you came in just before we started, you asked me some questions about your personal Wi-Fi at home. And really, there's two types of Wi-Fi. There's your personal Wi-Fi. Almost everybody has some experience with Wi-Fi at home. Honestly, that's usually simpler because you have one access point. You locate it in an area where you try to do uh, the majority of your, your work with it. And uh, you probably only have maybe three or four devices that, are co that connect to it. So there can be issues with that too. But when it comes to enterprise, where you have hundreds of access points and thousands of users trying to use the same infrastructure at the same time, that's when we run into the true challenges of Wi-Fi. So you need to know what to look for. You need to know what the tools are showing you. So in this presentation, we're going to take a case study, an educational case study, but this could be anything. And we're going to look at some different variables. And we'll call these the baseline best practices. There are plenty of variables, plenty of best practices out there. What we want to do in this presentation is take, we'll take the top 10 uh, most generic best practices, and then we'll bring in a case study. We'll take some samples, and we'll take a look using a very popular tool at how this particular network stacks up to these baseline best practices. And by doing this, you'll be able to follow along using one of these inexpensive tools, and you'll be able to tell yourself how is your Wi-Fi faring? And that's the point of the presentation. So turning bad Fi into great Fi starts with having some Fi in the first place. So if you haven't installed Wi-Fi, this is probably not the place to start. There are other courses, there are other uh, uh, tutorials that we have online, like in, in this situation, uh, or in person. Uh, as far as beginning to define what your needs are, where to place the access points, how many access points you need, what power and channels, things like that. But this one assumes that you've already got some Wi-Fi and you just want to, number one, take a look and see how well it's performing, and number two, get a little insight into what some of these mysterious best practices are. So let's go ahead and get into it.